on this episode of Living the Dream. Captain Jimmy Nelson travels to Grand Cayman to tackle some big offshore fish on Pickle Bank. Big yellowfin tuna on Yozuri top knot leader. After landing some massive tuna and a tenacious dolphin, the team checks out some of the world's most endangered turtle species at the Turtle Center and takes a dip with the team at Sunset Divers. Living the Dream with Captain Jimmy Nelson is brought to you by Salt Life. Live salty. Fish. Hey! Man, what a fish! Wow! Doesn't get any better than Baja. This is awesome! What I'm talking about. <laughs> We flew from Tampa, Florida to Grand Cayman on Cayman Airways. There's three different islands here in the Cayman Islands. But right here is my favorite place to be in the Caribbean. While we were staying here on the island, we were staying at Comfort Suites on Seven Mile Beach. It has a lot of amenities that work great for Louisa and I. They have a weight room that we can use every day of the week, which is great. They have an awesome pool. right there on the beach if we just want to walk out to the beach and hang out and just relax for the day. So you have all of the activities around you there, all of the restaurants and the shopping and everything else that comes along with it. out in the middle of nowhere if you want that busy nightlife it's here if you want that private secluded life on the beach kind of what a lot of people look for when they come to the Caribbean you have that as well along with the fishing and everything else the Cayman Islands has a lot to offer no matter what you're looking for and the goal for this trip was to go about 80 to 90 miles offshore to Pickle Bank. We left for Pickle Bank at about 10.30 at night and arrived there as the sun was coming up. And it was a pretty good day. It wasn't too rough. There were some waves out there and some wind, but it wasn't really that bad. We thought it was gonna be a little worse. And we were going to go for tuna, dolphin, and possibly marlin. The good thing about it is you can come here and recreational fish for those fish almost all year long. And there are so many tournaments here held in the Cayman Islands throughout the year. I mean, they even have the Cayman Islands International Tournament, which is, I believe, the highest dollar tournament in all of the Caribbean. So you can check that out on their website at the Cayman Islands Angling Club. And we started trolling, and not long after we started trolling, one of our lines got hit. Fish on. There you go, Jimmy. He's still moving. And we weren't really sure what it was. We thought it might have been a Cuda or even a small Wahoo. This one might be the right one. Get on him, brother. <laughs> That's what He's we're doing. He's still going. He's still going. If you tighten his drag down, I might be able to turn it. Yeah, we got one turn out of it. <laughs> He's got 100 yards and I got three inches. This is going to be a good fish.
Living the Dream with Captain Jimmy Nelson is made possible by Salt Life. Live salty. Sea Deck. Your boat deserves Sea Deck. CNH Lures. Be a winner with CNH Lures. Yozuri. Fish the best. Engel Coolers. The original high performance cooler. And by Cressy. Since 1946. Captain Jimmy Nelson is in Grand Cayman, and this time, he's after some big offshore fish. After taking a dip, the crew heads to Pickle Bank, located 80 miles offshore. Arriving with the sun, they begin trolling for dolphin, tuna, and the mighty marlin. Just minutes after putting a line out, Captain Jimmy hooks up. There you go, Jimmy. Think it's a good fish, whatever it is. We pulled that bull in the boat and it was a pretty good sized dolphin, that's for sure. Great way to start off the morning. So about five minutes of trolling so far, now a pretty good sized bull dolphin that does not want to go down easy. We actually foul hooked him right in the top of his head there. And the way you can tell a bull from a cow, if you don't know, is those bulls have that blunt head, that real square head. If that was a cow, the female, it would have more of a rounded head in the front. Dolphin are one of my favorite fish to catch because they're very beautiful fish. Look at those blues and the greens just lighting up in them right now. They jump all the time. They hit just about anything you throw at them. It's a great way to start, Frank. Absolutely. Man. It's going to be supper tonight, buddy. You got that right. After that dolphin, we ended up hooking a few barracudas in a row. Man, I think he got to off. He's still there. Yeah, he's still there. Is that a cuda? It's stacked up here this morning for some reason. But we weren't really going for those guys, but it didn't hurt us to catch some of those barracuda because we were going to go for tuna later on in the day, and we chunked for tuna with barracuda and blackfin tuna. After trolling for a little while and not really getting a hot bite going trolling, we decided to start chunking for the tuna. If you want tuna to come, put a lot of chum in the water. It really didn't take very long before the big yellowfin tuna showed up. Doubled up! This fish is moving, buddy! Jimmy, I'm enjoying being doubled up with you, but the best part about it for me is you got the bigger fish. Straight up and down, just like a yellowfin always does. They are definitely backbreakers. I've heard people say bonefish are the strongest fish pound for pound by no stretch of the imagination. Woo! This is nothing but work right here. This is all work. You want to come out and catch yellowfin tuna, be prepared to go to work. Love the CNH fighting belt, it's really lightweight. Definitely would not want to be fighting this fish without it. That's how we do it here. Cayman Islands Island Club in action. So one of the guys on the boat grabbed the gaff and got Frank's fish in the boat. Pickle bag yellowfin, Jimmy. Where's yours, man? He's out there still. You gonna make me beat you in the trap? You beat me. <laughs> you started first. You got a head start. So there I am, left fighting my fish, and it's still pulling. We got the boat in gear, and we're dragging that tuna along. Come on, buddy. Not much further. <laughs> you almost got him. Facing encouraging words. That fish keeps getting closer and closer to the boat. Color. There he is. There he is, Bobby. And we finally get an eye on it, and we see that it's another really good-sized tuna. And so we know now that we're in a school of bigger fish. Yeah, buddy. That right there is a good double prank. Oh, my gosh. Good job. Good Stick job. with us, man. Have faith. We'll get it done. <laughs> Never lost it. Woo! Good job, brother. Good Boy, job. that is a hefty yellowfin tuna right there. Thanks to a great crew. Captain Chris, Rob, Dez, Tom. We got it done for you, bro. There's the shout outs, guys. You heard them. That's who's making it happen. Frank, what's happening? You dropping the fish on me? I'm waiting to get, yeah. make another drift, man. <laughs> right. Hurry up. Woo. That's a good time, buddy. Good job, That's brother. Good, good time. job, man. Good job. What a good double right there. Yeah, beautiful yellowfin. That's a monster. 
That's an absolute monster. Like you said, came in style. Came in style. Like nowhere else in the world. Beautiful fish. It has turned into one tuna after another. We got him near the surface already, guys. There he is, right there on the surface. Ah, oh, come on, we didn't want that. And there he goes. Right, there he goes. Living the Dream with Captain Jimmy Nelson is made possible by Salt Life Optics, unparalleled clarity and contrast. Cayman Islands Angling Club, come experience sport fishing in paradise. Papa's Pilar, never a spectator. Plantation on Crystal River, the place to stay and play along Florida's nature coast. And by American Fishing Wire.